So I'm sitting in math class, watching each breath pass, and I can't wait for the moment when the bell rings so I can get up off my sore butt to walk out the door for Spanish through. When Mr. Certified College Degree stands up after example 3,580 who and decides he might shed some light on the students of Advanced Algebra 2, beginning with the statement, Listen guys, the fine arts are nice, but the future's advancing what the world really needs are scientists and mathematicians. After all, look at how few artists and writers make it. And by this time, my side of the table is violently shaking. I'm just saying that if you don't want to work at McDonald's or low income, Ooh. then I suggest you stick to something that will carry you far because, well, I never used a book to drive to school. And I hope you saw my jaw drop in disgust because, my goodness, I wanted to walk up and punch in his face. <laughs> my gnarly little fists of rage, but I clenched them under my legs and bit my tongue and swallowed a little bit of my spitfire blood. Well, sir, if you don't mind my literary prowess, let me teach you a lesson that'll stick to the right side of your cranium. <laughs> if hypocrisy is skin deep, then it's a blessing to be zit free. But you can see through clear it's the dictionary definition, so why don't you just shear your beard and think cheap? Because it's the only thing that we see. And I, if I apply these rhyming patterns to trigonometry, well, what a cow student I'd be. But that translation really isn't me. Honestly, conjunction, function, freaking teacher, luncheon. I don't give a rat's hat what you're munching as long as it's not my dreams and aspirations. Woo! What you don't know is that I need those, like I need rainy days and snow globes. Absent, they're not a detriment to my health, but my sanity's the unknown. Like I freaking love slam poems! Poems! <laughs> and that thing that dogs do where they run in their sleep. It's adorable. <laughs> torn to shreds if a silly man with a lanyard stood before you and his eyes keen and said, why well, I never used a piece of literature to make a phone call. Well, bloody H.E. a double hockey sticks neither denied, sir, but it's the language that you require, sir, to pitch your feelings to the heartbeat on the other line, sir. Yeah. Listen, sir, I have nothing against you, and let's be honest, Steve Urkel could kick your angle side side. <laughs> about anything math related and I can see why you would hate me for that jaded little act but I'd like to take a moment to stand up for the arts because yeah. it's the rhetoric we possess that sets us apart. Yeah. There's a level of grayscale mindset, a certain category of, well if you will, let's call it passion respect. And if you care to rip and tear on mine, I think you'd be better off spending your time throwing speeches on a dime in front of LA Fitness. Yeah. The sweaty electronic plastic jungle where all of your students' parents can bear witness. You're, you're going to run into people who will grasp your dream in their hands and try to crush it like a soggy grape, but you have to swivel around, lower your fist down, to pick your hands up and turn it into something truly great. They don't have the mindset, the mind, to digest what it means to be us, be it musician, screenwriter, or aspiring actress. So please, the next time an idiot tries to tell you, of all people, that the sky is supposed to be blue and you painted it a lovely tint of marmalade orange, I want you to smile kindly and say, well, certainly too busy hunched over those equations to glance at the Arizona sunset and you most certainly haven't seen what I'm up to accomplish just yeah!